Rats overrun a neighborhood. They're on the street, in the bushes, and on front decks. Good evening. I'm Jacqueline London. And I'm Jim Rosenfield. Neighbors in Longcrest say the rodents have changed the way they live, some of them not even letting their kids play outside. NBC 10's Aaron Baskerville is live on Howland Street tonight, and I know, Aaron, you saw these rats firsthand, and a lot of them. Head on a swivel, Jim and Jackie, head on a swivel. We've seen so many different rats out here, big, small, darting across the street, running up the sidewalk everywhere, about nine or ten houses on one side of the road. Over here, let me bring you closer. You can see some of the holes, about three or four. I'd call this ground zero. That's where we've seen so many rats running out of there into the gardens up and down here. I can tell you, people out here are literally screaming for help. Baby ones, big ones, climbing on the cars, running down the street. They're just out here like they run the block. There's no escaping the rats. They stare, they stop, they run. I don't know. I'm ready to move. There it goes. The look on her face says it all. They seem to be everywhere on Howland Street and Lawncrest. These large rodents are darting out of bushes <laughs> and scaring Damaris Rivera as she waters her garden. They're huge. They are huge. They look like cats <laughs> for me. I'm not exaggerating. She ran back that way. Antoinette Bethel Danzi is on the hunt. She tells us it's become a major creepy skin crawling issue in the last few weeks. There he goes. He ran behind the cooler. He's coming over. He's just sitting there. She claims dozens of rats are taking over the block. Broad daylight. They just sit on the step. I've recorded them and everything. Like. They just invite themselves to barbecues. It's just a mess. It's more than just a nuisance for them. They say it's a health hazard. They won't let their kids hang outside during these long, hot summer days. We have no idea what to do with these rats. We need y'all to come fix it because we have no idea what to do with these rats. So for now, all they can do is run for safety. If you come out here and visit Howland Street, that's what you're going to hear, a whole bunch of screaming and yelling. Another look at some of these holes. You'll see these holes in a bunch of different yards up and down Howland Street. One woman told me that she killed 17 rats at one time that were in her garbage. People out here tell me the health department was out here at some point, didn't find a whole lot. Of course, we reached out to them. We haven't heard back yet. For now, we are live in Lawncrest. Aaron Baskerville, NBC 10 News. It is no wonder your head was on a swivel, Aaron. Thank you. No way for people out there to be living. Appreciate it.